At Katie First. A lady. Not allowed to say pro wrestling or wrestler, yet your biggest show of the year is called WrestleMania. Yeah, okay. Hashtag tweet the tape. Ooh, burn, bitches. Sick burn. Uh, well, yeah, but they already branded it that, and they can't change that. Why not? We would call it sports entertainment mania. Hey, they can, they can have a fight for the naming rights of WrestleMania. What would you call it if you had the choice? Punchathon. Yeah, I'd call it Punchathon. Punchathon. Yeah, Punchathon. Yeah, and it would immediately tank. At B underscore. I can't call it WrestleMania, is what I'm saying. At B underscore double underscore D. Miz was a better Daniel Bryan than, well, Daniel Bryan. Hashtag tweet the table. At Lady Undertaker says, those alleged lost episodes of Total Bellas look more like reenactments. Hashtag tweet the table. And at Chris Mercado32 says, poor Tyler Breeze. I remember when he had that thrilling match with Jushin Liger. Now he's rocking a fake pair of tits. Hashtag tweet the table. Because he's a tit now. <laughs> yeah. Um, First of all, yes. Uh, Miz plays a better Daniel Bryan than Daniel Bryan. I don't know what that means. Well, like, he's just got at least – he was more entertaining as Daniel Bryan than Daniel Bryan is as Daniel Bryan. In the total Bellas. Yes. Okay, I get what you're saying. Yes. Like. Well, just it probably ever. No, no. <laughs> no. And the, one thing, the one thing I did notice is when he took off the, all the John Cena stuff, his hair parted the same way that it did when he was on Real World. And I was like, oh, fuck, I'm having a flashback. Yeah. This is weird. Real World New York, get out of here. No. Uh and in good analogy there with it, it was more like a reenactment. Because that it does feel like reenactments have people that kind of look yeah. like the people and they're shitty actors. Yeah, that was, yeah, better better analogy. 